Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good whatever time of day. Maybe if you, ladies and gentlemen, I'm the Layback Gamer, and we are back with some more rip, not rip world, Oblivion, uh, the modded Let's Play. And in today's episode, we're going to start by taking a look at our house now that it's fully furnished. I decided just before this episode was going to start, I do mean literally before this episode was going to start, that I would fold the, I would get everything, I would buy everything for this house. Oh, look at that, I actually have a, yeah, the, that's lying around here. But anyways, here's what the house looks like fully furnished. Very nice, very nice indeed. Do I have a, okay, yeah, we're good. We're good on carry weight. We are, I am going to have to go back to my home in the Imperial City in order to drop off some of this other stuff. Make sure we have some of this, some of the armor in there. I really got to sort through all these potions as well as the uh, ingredients that we got. But yes, we have fully furnished this house. Which is fantastic because the next house we're going to need, we're going to be doing is the Anvil House. And it's because, well, actually that one, we just need to complete the quest and we're done. And we're almost at that point. So, the other thing, then after that, if I recall correct, I believe... Is it the Shaden Hall house that's the next one? I forget. It's either Shaden Hall or Bruma. I forget which. I gotta quickly uh, pull this up on my tablet so I can uh, have a got have a reference for myself. No, I think while I do that, let's uh, let's get ready to. The other thing we need to do is we are in Leowin to retrieve. A, a Adarji's heirlooms. So, we're gonna have to start, oh, as well as hand in the tears of the saviors. So, why don't we, uh, the Garadin's tears. So, why don't we go ahead and make my way, make our way over to the Mage's Guild. And we will go ahead and trade with, trade those tears for hopefully a very big reward. In we go. Uh, let's see. Where are you? Sadrasa. Are you in here? No. Greetings, Warlock. Greetings. Ah, hello. You look like you've seen some travel. I have indeed. Ah, uh, the refined frost salts. Yeah. I've heard of mages who seal portals with an ingredient as a key. Makes the door impossible to lockpick. Refined frost salts sounds like something that Juliana would specialize in. You may want to go back to the university and speak to her. Uh, yes. So, uh, we're already done with that. Here are your tears. You found five of the tears? Fantastic. This turned out better than I expected. Perhaps a little bit of a bonus is in order. Thank you very much. Okay, I was wrong. It's actually the uh, Bruma... I believe Bruma House is the next one. Yeah. Bruma, the Bruma House costs 10,000 gold to get. So, we're going to be going for the Bruma House next, which we actually have the goal to be able to afford it right now. So the next time I find myself in Bruma, we're going to pick up the house. As well as see what else we can pick up it for uh, furnishings of that. But, I believe we are now officially at the halfway point of homes purchased in this game, which is quite exciting. Of course, there's, always, there's, the, uh, ec there, there's the unofficial stuff that we need to buy for... Or sorry, the uh, the DLC stuff that we have to buy for. But in terms of vanilla, what came with the game on release, we are halfway done with that. I think we're also... I think we might even be closing in on halfway done most of the very... Most of the uh, main input... The, the main... And I guess some... Most is in some side quests, maybe. I'm not 100% sure. No, we're not there. I'd say we're a third of the way done. Hopefully, we're going to be powering through a bunch of that in the coming days. But anyways, uh, Garadin's Tears, anything else you can tell me about them? 
They're the pride of my collection. It's good to hear. The tears look beautiful in my collection. A thousand thanks once again. I'm gonna be honest, I wasn't paying attention as to what reward we got for there, but eventually he will put them inside this display case there. At least I think he's going to eventually. We could to always take one. Oh, hello. What do you do? Sabi, Count's Mage and Castle. Oh, that's cool. You're the Count's Mage. You too. Alright, anyways, that quest is done with. Now we need to go talk to Adarji. Welcome. Something I I she has a house in here. No. That Hello, Numi. You mean? You tell about Leowen. Gods are my witness. I give that man the simplest list of things to do, and somehow he forgets half of it and gets the rest wrong. <laughs> Good day. Be seeing you. All right, where do you live? Have pity, sir. I got nothing to eat. Yes, hello. Now I know I can always ask one of the beggars where Darji lives, but I'd rather figure that out on my own. Also, I could alternatively I could look at the map to see where she lives. again, I'd rather try to... There we go. I knew we'd get it one of these times. Hello! You look very similar to that other Khajiit I just talked to. Hello, Adarji. Why does the prey approach me? Prey is looking to find something that the Predator has lost. Specifically, your ring. Yes. A filthy Argonian stole my precious ring. It was a gift from my mate. It has... Sentimental value. I will pay well. The stupid lizard hunts with the name Amusai. Find him, find my ring. Make him suffer. Kill him, and I will be pleased. This isn't the Dark Brotherhood. The guild heavily frowns upon killing. If you want him killed, go contact the Dark Brotherhood. But I will not be killing him just because you demand it. Stupid guild rules. He is only an Argonian. He is less than human and much less than Khajiit. If you must spare him, at least make him suffer. That I can at least do. Alright. Swift hunting. I'll go hunting around. Now, that Khajiit that we had found earlier, that beggar Khajiit, we could use her assistance. You're not a beggar, are you? I'm Otumil, but I didn't do anything, really. It wasn't me. <laughs> no, really? It wasn't me. Never. <laughs> Good day. Goodbye. It's you. Hi. Yes, it's me. I got nothing to eat. Hello. Me children will thank you for your help. Looking for a... Amusai, have you heard of him? A poor bugger was arrested. Seems he tried to swindle the Countess. He's rotting in a cell in the castle dungeon now. It's common knowledge that the jailers can be bribed to allow visitors to see prisoners. Hmm, good to know. Blessings. Thank you. One more. Here you go. Thank you, kind sir. Blessings of Akatos. Thank you for your generosity with that information. I think normally that's about 20 or 15 gold to bribe for that information. But because I'm just such a charismatic Argonian. Seriously, how, how, how do people think... I just gotta ask. How do people think this is the face of a super... Well, hold on. Let's take the hood off so we can actually see. How does... I don't recall putting that hair on. We're just going to... This is why we don't ever take the hood off. I didn't put... I could have sworn I didn't put that hairstyle on. Okay, uh, I think every time I do that, I'm reminded, hey, uh, this is why we have a hood on. Uh, okay, now that I'm, uh, jocked by... Oh, hello. Hello, slow-moving orc. Are you the Count? I am not. Then go away! 
No need to be mean about it. Let's hear it. Anyways, I need to find the dungeons. I believe the dungeon is down here. Fast to have walk. Damn, look at us. We look like we're on a purpose. Hello. Lost. I'm not. You're not supposed to be down here. Can I just Alright. I'm curious. I've never tried I don't think I've ever tried this before. Could we get you to like us to the point where you don't need a bribe? Alright, so that's pretty good. Is that so? Alright. Good one. Go. You can't scare me. Not bad. Not bad at all. Don't make me laugh. You're there we good. Go. Uh, Amusai. Uh, I'm looking to meet a prisoner named Amusai. Yeah, we got him here. Argonians aren't allowed visitors, though. Countess Alicia's orders. Which is the thing about the lizard folk. Really? Hmm. Well, it just so happens, I think I found this 20 gold on the ground. I, is Does this happen to be yours, by chance? Amuse, you say? I thought you wanted to, to see Amude. He's off limits. Amuse, though, it's just down the hall. Uh, make it quick. That's what I thought. But, I sir. Get back to work now. And now he actually likes it. Well, okay, so I guess we couldn't avoid that in that. Thank you, kind sir. Have a nice chat. There he is. Is there anybody else in here? No. Ah, the Thieves Guild's new favorite. Hello, am you say? Good to see you. What do you want? I'm looking. F How did you end up in Leowin, by the way? You were in the Imperial. Well, you were in the. You were in the Imperial City last, trying to join the guild. I guess you don't, didn't want to join up anymore, or try again later? The Thieves' Guild refused to take me, so I came here. Leowin is my home. It is where I was raised. <sighs> I went to the Imperial City in hopes of joining the Thieves' Guild. Now, I am forced to live as a freelance thief. Hmm. Interesting. Perhaps I can appeal to your, uh... Certainly. No, I can't. That's the highest that we go. There's no point in giving him gold. He's just gonna have it taken away. Adarji's ring. I heard you had it last, my friend. I should not tell you where it is. Here I sit in Leowin's dungeon while you are free. What will you do for Amusai if I tell you? I'll give you a chance at freedom. How about that? Single lockpick sound up to your interest? You do that for me. Maybe you guild types aren't so bad after all. Okay, it's a deal. Give me a lockpick and I'll tell you about the ring. It's a shame there wasn't an option to say, first you tell me about the ring, then I'll give you the lockpick and then you leave. Uh, not that I would pick it in this situation. One Argonian to another, I wouldn't want, I wouldn't pick that. Here's the lockpick. Sunlit freedom. Yes, I stole that ring from Adaiji. When I went to sell it, the fence told me I was too hot for him. He showed me an inscription on the inside. To Alessia. That had to be the Countess of Leowin. The damn ring was stolen property. Well, I figured I would ransom it back to the Countess, except she tricked me. I was arrested for theft, and she kept the ring. Uh, the Countess rarely leaves the castle. Good luck getting it back. Mm -hmm. I have to go back to the client, our client and inform him of the debt of unfortunate news, but you're welcome. Try not to sneak. Hold on, I I'm curious. Why don't I just bust you out? I, because I, I do want to see what happens. It's also a very hard lock, but again, I have like 137 of these picks, and every time, yeah, at least one of the tumblers will stay up if I accidentally botch this up.
You're free now. Do with that as you wish. I think there was a there's an instance in the game where if you do let somebody out, they will start to sneak out. I just didn't remember. You look lost. I'm not. So You're good. not supposed to be down here. I, yeah, we just had about this. Uh, what do you know about the recovered Caro family ring? I heard it was a pretty big deal. Oh, the Countess is very happy to have her ring back. I don't think she's taken it off for days. Though, if you want to hear the whole story, talk to Lidara. <laughs> the smile on his face. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> so you're not supposed to be out here. But I'm really excited to tell you this. Oh, I am so excited. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh Oblivion, you are oh one of the best games to ever to exist. Uh so how can we find count find Alessa Caro? Morning she is at the town chapel. At the castle she hosts the evening meal at eight. She retires sometime after eleven. She travels to Coral on the Ides of every month. Don't even try to find her between the fifteenth and seventeenth. All right, gotcha. Thank you for that information, my I good man. Back to work now. Yes. Hey, look, we're still good friends, right? We're one hundred and ten percent good friends. I'm waiting for Amusai to come around the corner. Ah, the thieves' guild's new favorite. Let's see what he does. No, he's just going to wait behind the door. Okay, so he's not even going to attempt to escape. I was really waiting for him just to sneak up and then you look the guard like just yells, Escaping prisoner! Granted, Amusei can't die, but... Uh, the look on the guard's face. Anyways... Let me just t talk about ru a rumor about a person directly when they're in earshot. Oh, Oblivion. Anyways, uh, I have some unfortunate... You're not in your house at the moment. Where would you be then? I think you're down at Three Sisters Lodge. If I recall correct. Three Sisters Inn. Eh, close enough. Hello? Uh, where the heck is she? Oh, there you are. Yeah, Darji, I have some bad... Again, you look very much like a Darji. Hello. I'm saving up. Have you seen a Darji around? She lives on the west side of town. She is fond of the three sisters in the Oh, okay, it's five claws. Blessings of Julia. So, she's over here, because it's about midday, I believe. Yes. Hello, Adarji. It hey. looks thievy to this one. Adarji. Why does the... I have some bad news about your ring. Uh... See, unfortunately, Amusei attempted to swindle it back to the Countess, and then ended up getting swindled himself. So, that's a bit of a problem. Does the hunter have this one's ring? Oh, no. Amusei tried to sell it back. Amusei tried to sell it to Alicia Caro. Ah, stupid lizard. Excuse me? Adarji uses the ring much more wisely. I use it to collect and sell information. That ring can be used to read private messages the Count writes. Get me that ring. Steal it from Alicia Caro if necessary. Just bring me the ring. I will pay double. That's why you always come back here first. Good day. Swift hunting. You can actually get double the gold. I think it even says here. The cat's out of the bags. Uh, apparently, you can use to read missives 
and other documents from the cat written by the count. She sells that information to the counts in Cyrodiil. Now that the cat is out of the bag, so to speak, she has upped the reward to 200 gold. Are we getting paid 200 gold for this? I think a heist like this is going to require a bit more, uh... I think it would be a little bit more gold, but anyways... Let's go in the castle and have a quick chat. Good to see you. Anyways, I think you are who we need to uh, talk to. Oh my! Are you an adventurer? Yes, I am. Good afternoon. Good day. What? I heard you uh, got your family ring back. Congratulations, Countess. I don't answer questions about royal jewelry from riffraff like you. Well then, we'll see. Perhaps I shall need to uh, use the Argonian charm that, apparently, and that, realistically, she should actually be speaking to me because she doesn't like Argonians. But allow me to use some Argonian charm. Sorry, I don't get it. That's that's just not funny. I see. How about now? I don't. Uh, fine. Yes. A little bit of gold help your case. Thank you. How kind. Yes. After all these years, I have my ring back. I wear it all the time now. Of course not when I sleep. I am a proper lady after all. Hmm. Good to know. Good to know. Be seeing you. Now, I am curious, and just Greetings. bear with me a second here. Yeah, I didn't think so. To say, bear with me. Oh my! Is this is? I, I just want to see if it was actually in her inventory. Greetings. Good day. It's my pleasure. Please continue. Yes, yes. Uh, I'm gonna have Please, to. Oh, you're go good. On. Can you tell me about the Caro family ring? Countess Caro is so relieved to have the ring back. It's been missing for many years. She wears it constantly. Not all the time. I mean, she puts it in her jewelry box for baths and at night. No proper lady would wear her jewelry to bed. Yeah, good to know. Good day. I think I hear my lady call. Hello. Two of the afternoon watch and all. Can you tell me about the recovered family ring? I don't think it would be appropriate. Okay, fine Go then. Ahead. Allow me to start. That's just nope. stupid. That, not now. I wish I could say that's just stupid. What a dumb. Don't talk. So, sorry. Whatever you want. All right, I get it. This is just too easy. Okay, you won't say anything else. And you say we arrested that miscreant. That stupid lizard tried to blackmail the countess. Okay. There's something else that we can learn. So why don't we go ahead and. Have another chat with the beggars. I'm listening. Because the beggars, they know a few things. The beggars are quite smart. I thought we could pry this this next bit of information directly from the handmaid and without having to go to one of the beggars. I'm saving up. Yeah, so what can you tell me about the family ring? So Alessia Caro has recovered her ring. And now you want to know where she keeps it so you can steal it back. Yes. My pockets are a little light at the moment, if you know what I mean. Oh, I know exactly what you mean. I think I I happen to have spotted a coin purse that had ten coins in it. I believe this was yours at one point, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know where she keeps the ring, but I know who does. Talk to Ladara Mothril. The Countess's handmaiden. She eats dinner in the castle at the Eighth Bell. You may have to sweet talk her, but she knows all about Alessia Caro's habits and schedule. You should know that there are other secrets in that castle. What kind of secrets do you know about? I've heard of a hidden torture chamber. They say that Count Marius interrogates Argonian immigrants from Black Marsh. The servants whisper that the Argonians are dragged into the basement and never seen again. 
You should stay out of there, just in case. Mm, secret torture chamber. I was about to say, that kind of seems a little odd that you wouldn't know about it personally, but then the added detail of they're never seen from again is... Oh, okay, that, that explains why he's never heard. He's never actually seen it. Because he wouldn't... He wouldn't be here telling me about it. Any rumors? Hey, you're the one they call the hero of Kavach, aren't you? The one that closed the Oblivion Gate and saved the city. That's me. Don't Blessings didn't hear. Upon me. You didn't hear about this from me, okay? Ooh, hello. Yoink. I'll happily take that Nurn root. Alright, that was the little detail. I thought we may have been able to have uh, right away asked the, handma or the handmaiden if we had uh, a high enough of a count. Oh my! Are you an adventurer? Yes. A pleasure to speak with you. Yes, hello. I've, uh, I've heard about some dark secrets in this castle. Would you mind uh, spilling the beans before I spill the beans? Shh! It's dangerous to be heard talking about that. The Countess has a secret passage somewhere in the basement that leads to her private quarters. That's where the torture chamber is. Sometimes I can hear the screams of the prisoners when I'm in my chambers. Right. Good to know. Good to know. What, what, thank you very much for your kind service. I think I hear my lady calling. Okay, yes, you go to that. All right. I'm not the best when it comes to sneaking, but I know a little something that will help me out during this. Alright, so... I believe... It's actually... Through here. That's the servants' quarters. Or is it through this one here? I think it's... yeah. That leads to the basement. So, we're just going to hang around in the castle. And, you know, we're going to be mingling with people, just talking, having a good chat. Maybe even because, you know, we're a famous hero from Kavach, we were invited to sit down and have dinner with the Count. You don't like yes. me enough to be able to reveal this. I don't think I like that question. Yeah, good day. Yeah, let's just pretend that we're part of this dinner party that's going on here until apparently midnight. Good to see you. Good to see you. Yes, it was good to talk to all of you. I'm sure you uh, are excited to hear about all my brave adventures in Oblivion. Count's bodyguard. Yes, good day, everybody. I will uh, be retiring outside the castle. Well, that's what they think. What they think. All right. I'm not taking the hood off because I'm not bare. I'm not uh, letting people have to see that. But I am going to go ahead and. Uh... Oh crud! I'm gonna have to keep the boots on, aren't I? Sorry, the gloves. Our boots don't actually provide, uh... Yeah, they don't provide that. That sucks. Hoping to do this without the gloves, but... Oh, I know, there we go. We're in this orcish helmet. And we have instead... Uh, we're not... Uh, we don't have... We don't often have a Templar sword. By the way, that is a nice-looking sword. Just have to say that that is a very nice looking sword. If I can find a second one, I'll happily wield it. All right. Okay, I'm gonna need to take the boots off because it might be easy to discover. All right. Now, I think I will attempt to do this. Uh, Let's see, so there's an entrance somewhere in the basement here. I were an entrance... Ah, I think I found it there. And, oh, hello. Here we go. Shut that. I think I'm moving up into this torture room. 
Now this is the one thing I really liked about these Thieves Guild quests, is that you could sneak through sneak through these hidden areas of the castle. That's what really makes this awesome. And look, here's the torture chamber. Now, I, f I think it would be rude of me not to at least vandalize this place a little bit. Pitchfork. Ugh. Disgusting. I think they would be doing this to the Argonians. Oh, I'm appalled. Come on. Hmm. Yeah. Three. Sure, I'm gonna take it. The best I can kind of vandalize this area. Careful about dropping that on my feet. Of course they have a viewing chamber to be able to watch as the Argonians are tortured. And there we go. You know what? I'm stealing your finery too. Your... Yeah, I'm stealing that kind of finery. Okay. Now, I am going to attempt to see if I could do this without needing the invisibility potions. I probably will need the invisibility potions, because I don't think my sneak is that good. Sneaks. Uh, it's... On the higher level of Apprentice. Probably going to need it. Yeah, I'm probably going to need it. Maybe we'll do a different segment that we don't use invisibility potions. Better not close that one. Be a little difficult to get back in. Very, be very, very quiet. Sneak through here. They want to be on this side of the door. Or do I want to? No, 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 hold on. I want to be on this side of the door. I actually have the door to provide a little bit of cover. We creak it open and then pop one of these. Probably would have been spotted right there. Be quick about this. Before the guard comes back. Very quiet. Absolutely quiet, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, we have Divining the Elder Scroll, plus a Diarji's Ring. Let's see if I can sneak out without being detected. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, that was awesome. And we'll just 
Click that number up. Sneak into here. And keep going. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, hold on. Let's... Oh, excuse me. Alrighty. Uh, should make sure to come back out in our uh, better clothes. Nope, oh, no, not those boots. Where is the elven boots? Yep. Uh, I think that's everything. Yeah, that's everything. And uh, of course, with the dragon bow. Dragon bow? I don't really have that equipped, though, huh? That was the last one I had equipped. Oh, it's because I was fighting and I didn't want to use charges of that. Okay, let's go with the katana. So I am on my way out of the castle. Good day. <laughs> we are the best thief around. <laughs> are you gonna? Nope, you won't. Okay, very well then. She'll go nap it off. Hello. What can I do for you? Uh, honey, Lisa Carl. Don't think I like that question. Nope. Uh, you too. You don't have to say anything. Pardon me. And in the morning, she will freak out when her ring is gone. Be very cross about it. Alright, am I good to use this bed? Oh, look at that. I can use this bed. Let's rest up for a couple hours. Let's go! Oh, that makes me very happy indeed. It got in, got out, and not an ounce of trouble. I remember the first times I tried that, I would always get caught by the guards. What is this place? The Blue Fig Bakery. Okay. Anyways. Hello, hello. Why does the prey approach me? I have some news about Adarji, about your stolen ring. What? Oops. Ah, uh, wrong one. Does the hunter have this one's ring? Yes, I do, as a matter of fact. I think Ka you might want to be careful with this for a little while. I'm sure Countess Kara will be very, very upset about its loss. My ring. Oh, thanks to the claws of the clan mother, you have recovered it. Is that slimy Argonian dead? Did he suffer long? I hope so. You have earned the reward. The Thieves' Guild was always good to Adaji's dearest mate. I am grateful that the memory is still honored. Yes, we will honor that for good for life. Swift hunting. Yes, thank you. Now, I better get out of here before people discover what I've done. How goes it? It goes good. Thank you, madam. Right, I don't think we have any more business in here. So, we gotta go back to uh, Breville, which we'll pick up another quest. We gotta go back, to, we're gonna go all the way up to Coral. And I have a couple, of a case to go to Anvil, because, well, two case to go to Kovach. We may as well go to Anvil while we're in that direction. Uh, let's see, I need to go to Shaden Hall. Alright, let's see where... I don't think you like me. Either that or you really like me. I don't like it either way. Alright. Let's go. The road should still be fairly cleared. It had. Hello. A pleasure to speak with you. I'm sorry to say that your uh, your leader is dead. He's, uh, he suffered a terrible accident. It was absolutely tragic what happened. I see these guys are still sprawled out.
You yep. Come on. Uh. Somebody's gotta clean the roads up and then apparently it's going to be me today. Come on. Ooh, don't drag it right into me. Good enough. Actually, I think a better place would be underneath the bridge. Come on, come on, get underneath the bridge. Almost there. Need to go backwards. Come on, we'll keep the but we'll keep the road fl clear of human corpses. That way, it doesn't ruin any reputations. There we go. Hopefully nobody notices that dead body just hanging out underneath the bridge. Are people, are people going to notice that? Eh, it's far enough away. You can't. It can't even see it from here. Realistically, yeah, somebody probably would notice that. Although, then again, I would probably have attempted to tie a rock to the body in a couple spaces, and then let the body just sink and decompose in the bottom of the in the bottom of the ocean of the lake or a river, I guess. All right, let's get over to Breville. Crud, I ran out of water again. Oh, hello, madam. Oh. Uh-oh. Wait a minute, it's a day drop. You know what? I don't have time to deal with you guys. Besides, I am speed. You know that, you know, ladies and gentlemen, they used to call, they also used to call Slim, Slim the Quick, because he was too fast. Look at his, serious the, the jogging animation on them, it looks ridiculous. If, so, if you know somebody in this life who can jog like that, that is impressive. And also, who can jump over creatures that are t as tall as you are. Whee! <laughs> you fool. You tried to lash out at me. Oh, you tried. But you didn't do it well enough, because I am slim the quick. I am too quick for you. Oh, oh, wait, oh. Oop, I didn't mean to jump over the bridge. Actually, yeah, I probably did. Nobody can catch me. Soon I will be maxed out in all stats, and then I will really be quick. Hello, bear. Whoop. <laughs> you just imagine if I were to... S <coughs> if I were just to then hop off the top. Let's see if I could hop off the top. Oh no, the bear moved. Ouch. I don't want to try it. Okay, you're being a little hostile. I was going to try and jump off your head. Like I'm in Mario. But I don't think that's going to work. Oh, tasty graphics. Huh? Oop. Oop. Wee 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 wee. <laughs> oh. Oh, you can't hit me, you can't hit me, you can't hit me. Okay, I lied, apparently you can hit me. Okay, I, I, I'm sorry for teasing you. 
Come on, come on. Keep on me. We have a bunch of people in Breville that are probably itching for a fight. And I'm itching for a little bit more cash. Come on, come on. Follow me. Follow me to your doom. Yes. The bridge is just over here. If you guys want to catch me, you're going to have to try. Try a lot harder than that to catch me. Well, apparently, uh... This bear is still adamant on... Oop! Oop! Hey, there's our black bear friend! Look at that, the whole... Oh my goodness, that was close. Look at that, the whole part, the whole party's here. Everybody's reunited back together. Aw, oh, it is almost admirable. Hello, guards. Yes. No, not me. Go after him, yes. Yes, I, I don't know who keeps dragging all these animals into here for you guys to, to, to have to face. <laughs> oh, jeez, I almost fell. Oh, hello. Dang, look at these guys go. I'm about to be pincushioned. Nope, there is. Hello. Oh, there's one there. I'm just warming up. This is up here. Who are you? This is a hopeless guy card. I'm gonna punch this bear to death. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I just love what's going on here. This is awesome. <laughs> look at the look. Just look at the carnage. <laughs> the bear is dead. I'll take that. Thank you. <laughs> I don't mind if I just take all of these. Now, I believe there is at least one other bear and a bandit inside this town. Inside this part of town. There you are. Excellent. Apparently a boar. Ah, perfectly balanced as all things should be. How goes it? I love this game. Just run into, drag a couple enemies into town, and everybody be the goes. Hi. How goes it? Hello, you are Blackwood Company. Sir. Uh, never change, Oblivion. Never change. Good day. Good day indeed. I offer the finest goods and lowest prices in all Cyrity. Now oh, that's funny you should say that because I'm about to test that. Can I increase that by a little bit? Oh, I can. And you could take this one. Uh, I should probably consider bringing a couple of these weapons back with me. Take that, this. We do really make some nice money off of that stuff. You. Anyways, I have to, to go talk with. Where are you? This your house here, Scriva, who is not. Oh, we have a probably at one of the probably at the other end. That's where I would be. How do you do? Ugh, that water just looks filthy. Hello. Now listen closely, Bob. Millicent's my girl. The night side you home, she's talking to, and you are not on the list. I don't care, Marvin. Do you think I fear Marvin? I don't. I really not. Uh, Master June. Master June has one sister, quite as mad as he. No clue what they want in Bravo. 
would wonder if they just fall for the nice pentagram. I need to get care of my uh, strange person. I don't really care about you. All I care about is a cat in the back corner. What is it? Hello, traitors. Look at the muscles on you. Oh, why, thank you. The blessing of the fox upon you. Hello. You have returned? Yes, I have, uh... Are you okay? Uh, look, I, I complete the quest if that's what you're doing this for. Good work. You are truly an asset to the guild. I will make sure the Grey Fox himself hears about this. I am promoting you to Prowler. Congratulations. Thank you. Now, you got any more jobs? I have a small problem that you may be able to help with. The guild will even pay a reward. That buffoon, Hieronymus Lex, has invaded the Imperial City waterfront. Imperial watch guards from all over the city prowl the streets. All right, how bad is it? Hieronymus Lex has vowed not to leave until the Grey Fox is in custody. The Fox is safe, but the Thieves' Guild cannot do business like this. The poor of the waterfront are kindred to the Grey Fox and will not betray him. However, cubs soon get hungry. Soon someone will break. Many Guild members could be jailed. Find Methrodil in the Imperial City. She is coordinating the guild's response. All right. Looks like this is where our quest is. Shadow hide the hunter. Excuse me. Good to know. So, we need to get over to the Imperial City and lift the siege on the waterfront. I'm trying to remember what quest comes after that. I think I know what quest comes after that, but at the same time... I'm not a hundred percent sure. The quest I'm thinking of, then... Cobra encumbered again. If it's the quest that I'm thinking of, then we'll definitely be taking that on. Right, we'll take that on right away. Is this one's just gonna require us to go over to Breville, take care of it, come back. Hello, Miss Spriggan. You know what? Let's take a bit of a shortcut. The roads just aren't safe anymore. However, for some reason, there is very little wilderness in this game. Oh, running through the wilderness. Enjoyable part. Oh, hello. Hey! The unicorn! Forgot about you. As well as the massive minotaurs. Where are they? Are you actually specially named? <gasps> yep, Minotaur of the Grove. Hi. What if I were to take you back with us? Yes, follow me. Get all of you guys killed at once. Woo! <laughs> that was a close one. I think there's a, a shrine of here scene. You guys want to get in on this? Oh my god. Oh my god, that was a bad time to run out of uh, juice. Oh, Ouch. Right, I'm trying to kite the Minotaur's back, but this bear is making it difficult. On top of that, I think I'm about to have a sprig. Nope, we managed to dodge the spriggan. Oh, I'm also at a Magicka too. Alright, let us... Pop one of these. Uh, probably going to pop that and it healed. We'll go with one of these for now. That's a got an imperial wall. Oh my goodness! 
What's that? <laughs> I just love creating chaos, apparently. <laughs> I smell wood smoke, yes. <laughs> yes, go, chaos, go! Oh, sweet, we got one down. I can't take the hammer. Can I take that hammer? I could just take that hammer. Did the kid be just. Yep. Whoop! Yet yeah, the conjure's coming after me. I fought mud crab. Jeez, your dagger hits hard. Do I have a poison that I can use on you? I don't think I do. Cha uh, is unfortunate. Well, sorry, I probably have a poison in here, it's just not a poison that I can use against the Conjure. Somebody else die? Oh my goodness, one of them actually died. Ouch, I got hit. Uh, well, not a bad loss, I guess. I don't think I have an iron bow, so we'll take that. Ouch! Dang you! I will need to use one of my, uh... Where is it? Not swathe. Uh, but I'm not attacking right now. Oh, I don't have the arrows equipped. Excellent, you're dead. Uh... Oh, that's not good. I don't think I needed you guys for anything. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, that hurts. That hurts bad. Ouch. Let's get major wounds going. Yes, keep coming this way. Oh, look, one of those uh, runes, one of the conjuring rune stones. Well, I'm sorry to that uh, uh, to hear scene. Uh, we may or may not have gotten your followers killed. Good news is, is that we're uh, going to clear out the grove. Oh, wonderful. Archer? I'm unsure. Anyways, uh, let's just pop another wireless stone. Sorry, Welkin stone. Will they follow us into the water? Oh god, no, that- this is bad. That's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Ouch. Where'd he go? Mr. Minotaur, what do you have to say about being shot in the face? Seriously, pay attention to me, Mr. Minotaur. I'm 
now trying to cut you in the behind. Oh, oh, oh okay, okay, okay. He, he did not like that. Oh, I've taken some bad hits here, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if I'm going to make it. I'd be lying if I said that, if that was a lie. That made absolutely no sense. Uh, I don't I think I have enough back. Oh, I can always summon one of the scamps out. I can't summon, uh, unfortunately, our date, our, our uh, fire atronach. Got one of them figured out the way. Oh, you're the healthier one. Did you just take out that other guy? Thank you. Now, the only issue is, is I gotta figure out something else. I gotta drop something. You could take that. I don't really want that. Alright, here we go. Let us, uh, as we're on the potions effect. Wait, 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 what? Oh. Oh, look at that! Look who's came to come to the rescue! Thank you. I also see a rather valuable ebony warhammer. I will happily trade it for the elven one. Show me what you've I'm got. This is the part Wait. where you fall down and bleed to death. They just a yeah, different mind. Okay, let's see here. Do I have another pot? Do I have anything that's going to, uh, increase my, uh, carry capacity for a bit longer? Skuma technically would. Hmm. Do I have any magic that might do that as well? Fortify fatigue. That would do it, but I don't. Uh... Okay. Uh... Out. You know we're a little desperate for uh, carry weight when we're using a spell that literally allows us to be crisped by the sun. I really need to make a uh, a feather spell that also fortify oh crud that also fortifies strength. Probably try that out the next time. All right, so we should be seeing some watchmen. Yep. No sign of him. Don't worry. Oh, crud! I'm over encumbered. Which one was this chest? Uh, oh, this was the clothing. Uh, I suppose we can, uh, just for the moment, put that into here so we can actually move around. Probably, I should pr yeah, we'll put the, we'll put that into there. Let's see here, did we ever, did we get a iron bow? We do have an iron bow, okay. I can sell that. The Templar sword, we can keep. Ebony Warhammer, I don't have an Ebony Warhammer. That's good. Alrighty, I'm gonna have to really get rid- I gotta consider- I gotta sell all the arrows that don't do 9 or 10 damage. Alright, this was you- this was enchanted weapons as well as our necklaces. And a, uh, and that. Uh, we can sell those off. I have that. Ebony- the ebony one I didn't, but the other one I did. I had that. 
got some steel to put away as well as orcish. Let's first just see what we got for orcish and steel. Let's see here. Okay, I got the shield, but I didn't have the helmet, so that's good. I just need the gauntlets, and then we're good there. And steel, I don't have anything in steel, so. Didn't have that, that's good. Probably afford to dump the scrolls too, and then I think about it. Yeah, this is where I've been doing with all the scrolls. Alright. Excerpts from tra excerpts translated from something. Uh, oh, look at that. I actually had a magic tome in here that I can eat, that I can uh, read. Is this where... did I put my tomes into here? Yes. Put the book away too, you take that. That. Put anything away that I don't need. Actually, I should probably read what this, uh, translated, uh, where is it? Yeah, there we go. Which one was this for again? Was this for that, uh, Ogre Quest? Yep. That was from the Ogre Quest. By depersonalizing. Uh Oh, this is something for OBS. Gotcha. Okay. We uh should probably keep that. Handwritten note. Basically scrawn note. Alright. Yeah, anyways. Now let us store our ingredients into here. I find a uh no. Love journeyman for those guys. Alrighty. I think I'm gonna have to probably. Oops. I have to go on a uh, another selling spree. Nope. Uh, eh, yeah. Let's just put the nern root into here. Six minotaur horns. Dang, we were rocking. Nothing for now. And welcome back. You have made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed. Hit that subscribe button if you really enjoyed. Maybe share this video to anybody who you think will enjoy my content. And also don't forget to check out some of my other stuff. I don't only, I'm not only doing this game, but I also have done a ton of other games. Well, a ton, I think. Cap. Well, I'm not sure how many games I've done at this point, but anyways, here's a little, small little bit of collection of games that I've done. And if you look on screen, it should take you to either another video or a playlist. Maybe you'll enjoy that. Perhaps you might not. I don't know. We will find out. Hope you all enjoyed, and until next one, take it easy.